And covering Colorado takes us to Frisco, where boating season isn't very far off. A $4 million project they're calling the Big Dig is well underway at the Frisco Bay Marina. The project will move 85,000 cubic yards of dirt out of the lake bed around the marina at Lake Dillon. That should allow boaters a longer season, and today the public was invited in to see those workers in action. CBS4's Gilligan, Matt Kroschel, wanted to check things <laughs> out too, and Matt, such a popular spot for boaters, and man, they got an eyeful today. Yeah, there's a lot of excitement out here at the Frisco Marina. The contractors parked all their uh, machinery here, and basically it's become a kid's playground as uh, everyone's coming out here to check out the work going on already in the marina, and it is a huge project. Getting up close with the monster equipment tasked with Frisco's Big Dig. This marina here, it's such a tremendous asset. The project is massive. Drone 4 flies over some of the dirt work already well underway, creating deeper channels for boaters, lengthening the boating season by months. It's just going to give more room to play and get outside and enjoy these, this beautiful sunshine. It's so big. The Touch the Truck event is a way to give this community a behind the scenes view of the projects. And it's really an opportunity to shut down the equipment, get the community in here. The grade in the bay will be lowered by up to 13 feet in some spots. And it'll be one foot lower than the glory hole over by the dam. So as long as water is spilling over that overflow, we'll be able to bring our boats and our paddlers in right here to the marina. And they're building a much larger high country style sandy beach. It's actually going to be expanded upon quite substantially. Uh, there'll be a nice large beach. These crews are on schedule to cut the ribbon on this big dig by June 1st. Future phases of this project include a full year time restaurant here on land they're actually constructing by pulling out that dirt from the bottom of the lake. They also hope that they can add some more trails out this way, better parking and more restroom facilities. We are live in Frisco, Matt Crochel covering Colorado First. Thank you, Matt. Just a great recreational area up there.